At your local election headquarters, ABC4 News is there for you with team coverage of the 2022 midterm elections. ABC4's Kayla Backerly is in Orem for us following the latest on the proposal to create a new school, new school district and split from Alpine. But first, let's check in with ABC4's Jordan Burroughs. He's been following the Senate race between Senator Mike Lee and his independent challenger, Evan McMullen. That race came to a close last night with McMullen conceding just before midnight. While Mike Lee is the projected winner from a th for a third term, this is by far his most competitive challenge yet. Now, Jordan, what are the big takeaways from political experts on this? Courtney, the big takeaway is that it may take decades for an independent or a Democrat to take uh, a seat in the U.S. Senate representing Utah. They say if that person were to run as more of a moderate, they then could unseat the Republican that is in charge. Obviously, we know that is Mike Lee at this point. He is on his third term. Uh, we spoke to James Curry. He's a political science professor at the University of Utah. He says this election was actually more about Mike Lee. This was the closest any of his three elections for U.S. Senate in Utah have been. Uh, we know back in 2010, he won by 29 points. In 2016, he won by 41 points. And obviously, right now, we know the poll are, are not officially uh, closed and all those votes are counted between McMullen and Lee, but Lee right now is ahead by maybe 13 to 14 points. Uh, we know last night both of them spoke to their supporters. Uh, McMullen said he conceded the election to Lee, so both of them uh, took the podiums at their respective places to talk to their supporters. McMullen did not talk about his future during his speech last night, but political experts say that uh, he's well known in the state, so he could have a chance of uh, winning some sort of political office uh, in the future. Uh, James Curry says McMullen's campaign and defeat should be a learning lesson for the Democratic Party. Evan McMullen sh is showing Democrats that you can do OK, probably still can't win, if you run somebody who's a bit more moderate against some of these Republican incumbents, that it's not just the label that's the problem. It's also the policy positions for Democrats. And maybe this should inspire them. Even though McMullen did lose to Mike Lee, James Curry says that McMullen should be proud of himself because of an independent taking on that Republican candidate. He says one of the best things about McMullen's campaign is that he is well known. We know that he ran for president uh, a couple years, a few years ago now, so he has cemented himself as an independent here in Utah. Reporting live in Salt Lake City, Jordan Burroughs, ABC4 News. All right, thank you, Jordan.